I was driving through campus with a girl with her face glued to her phone, <laughs> walked right out in front of me. I couldn't avoid her and hit her with my car. Um, she was injured. Am I going to be responsible for her injuries? She was not in a crosswalk and I was not speeding. So, ah, the whole cell phone question. You know, distracted driving, yeah. distracted walking, distracted everything. I mean, this is one of those situations where, you know, just because something happens, something bad happens to somebody, it doesn't mean there's any liability. And in this particular case, you know, you got to take care of yourself. Just because you're driving your car and you're doing everything you're supposed to be doing and somebody is not paying attention and doesn't do what they're supposed to be doing, it's just like they're driving a car. So there is what in Alabama is called contributory negligence. And if you're driving a car and you're looking down at your phone, you're being negligent. If you are walking and not paying attention to where you're going, you're being negligent. And so in Alabama, uh, contributory negligence. If you contribute to cause your own injury uh, under the law, you may not be able to recover. So in this particular case, I would say that the, uh, the, the, person, the, e the person with the email uh, question is not going to be held responsible for this particular case.